This is Rama Devi. She's one of the top performing vision entrepreneurs here in Andhra Pradesh, India. Today we're in Bama Rajpali, a village of about 800 people. She and her husband are running an eye camp to screen people for presbyopia and sell affordable reading glasses. It's a combination of near vision tests, far vision tests, referrals, and crowd control. After the camp was done, we got to spend some time with them at their home to find out what makes them so successful. They say that uh, to become successful, to sell more glasses, you have to, uh, when you are in a village, always keep an eye on the potential test buyers. Uh, particularly in that age group, identify those people, meet them, explain them, explain them about test uh, biopia, and also demonstrate, like uh, asking them to read a paper and uh, use a plus one or a plus one point and try to show them the difference and show them how that would benefit them. So she says that when you are in business, you cannot be you cannot be shy. Uh, you should open up and talk to people. Uh, if you keep yourself shy, then you are not going in business. The work is not very difficult the way they are doing it now, but it's almost it's always uh, more helpful if you work in a, in a team. Uh, with the early income of just 3000 rupees, it was only sufficient for the day to day living. They couldn't uh, acquire any uh, property. Like uh, Now they got a bike, but, but of course they've taken it on loan, but in the next two months it's going to be theirs because they're going to repay the entire loan. From their work at Vision Spring, Rama Devi and her husband consistently earn about 9000 rupees or $230 per month, which is triple what they used to earn at their previous work. Ramadevi also actively lends a hand to other vision entrepreneurs who are new to rural sales and marketing. But with a goal to double her sales in the coming month, she and her husband will be a tough act to follow. So he feels he's no inferior to her. He, he appreciates her selling skills, but he feels he's no inferior to her. They both are. Well, they are two. They are two.